let's be honest guys we all want to learn how to make money in forex right so this is my friend Sasha Dominikov and I'm sure you guys know him already and he'll be teaching us on how to trade on forex hope you guys are doing amazing to buy Sasha you guys know me as a youtuber tiktoker and more forex is not as complicated as you see it, mm -hmm. it, it it's simpler the more you do it uh, I'm gonna break it down to you guys as simple as possible because right now I do not have my laptop but I will use my phone to check the charts my laptop's kind of dead right now I'm not exactly gonna tell you how to trade because I do charge for courses basically the market is two things okay it's a buy and a sell green for buy sometimes blue and most of the time red is for sell okay. that, that's basically the simple thing because a lot of you ask me how to trade how to what do I download you need a broker first of all you'll get that anywhere on chrome yeah. you go search one of the best brokers that I trade with currently is Mono. So you get the broker, you sign in. A broker is a person, it's like a bank, you know. You can't go buy something without having money in the bank, right? Okay. So you need, that's what a broker is. So you deposit your money into your broker. And then from there, you take it into an MT5. MT5 is the platform where you trade. So it's connected to your broker. So you've done your broker. You've already sorted out who, who you're working with. You've, you've downloaded the app, which is MT5. Probably, I would say you go under Moono because I also use it. I think it's a good broker with no unbiased opinions. When it comes to actually just trading, it, it's not easy. You still lose. Another thing people don't understand about trading is they'll call it a scam if they lose, man. Because you lose so many times, you just assume that you can just quit. I've been doing Forex for six months, but I honestly started making money after, I think, my fourth month. Okay. First month of trading with Forex. And the reason I started doing it was because I was like, how are kids? Like, I'm looking at maps. I'm like, this is nearly the same age as me and he's he's making a lot of money. How is this possible? So when you put it in that perspective, you're like, Forex shouldn't be that hard to learn. If you know what to do, you it's, it's very easy to make a lot of money in this, okay? You place your buy and sells here. That's where you enter your trades. There's not really much. I'm literally just telling you how the app works. I'm not going to tell you exactly about the demand the trend lines and so on or retests and one more thing what currency do you use to trade in the forex game i'm also known as uncle nasdaq so i love nasdaq because of the sharp movement and how much money you can make off of it currently what i've moved on to i started trading gold more often and usd jpy so i think i think those are my two soft one I'm, I'm comfortable with them before sasha gets to answer my questions what's the purpose of signing under someone's link i want you guys to please answer this one for me i like your type shit so you said how much is this thing again hmm? how much is this if you guys know the answer to that please comment down below so the first thing that i always wanted to ask is um like what's the purpose of signing under someone's link that's actually a very good question okay a lot of people think this is also another reason why forex is a scam because why would you promote something when you already have so much you're, you're showing that you're showing people you have 400k you're making 400k profit. most of the time they're not actually making 4k those are called fake live accounts it looks real but it's not but on the other hand the reason why even the richest people still promote their links is because with forex you also make money two ways when someone is trading under your link, you are also making money. If they're making profit, you're also making a certain percentage of profit with them. So that's the reason people ask you to at least join their links. And there's a lot of money. Even with the courses, you'll find out if you calculate properly, one th if 1,000 people sign under a 1,000 course, that's a million rand. So if you think about it, it's not that far of a reach. You know, it's very much possible. So that's that's how I started thinking about it. It's, it's not that hard. And if you really, really think about it, the courses are not the reason why Forex is a scam at all. People just trying to make extra hustle. If you, like, let me say, I sign under his link, when I'm in profit, you're also making a certain percentage of profit from it. Yes. From me or the broker. Uh, it's I think it goes both ways, for the broker and me. So, but it's not like, it's not like massive profit. It's not like profit enough to say, yo, that, that's life-changing profit. Oh, yeah, bro. The second question is that I've always wanted to know, right? Since you said something that um, the broker is like the bank, right? Yeah. So, when I lose my money, does it benefit the broker? Yeah. Oh, yeah, your money goes straight to the broker. It goes straight to the broker. Yeah. So, technically, when I'm winning, is the broker losing? Yes. You're eating the broker's money. That's why I take, that's why some brokers... You'll find out you have a withdrawal 50k, but they, they, they're fighting or they want to give it to you. 
that's exactly why because you're fighting against their money so that's why most of us like promote the brand so that if you're close you're less likely to get backstabbed if you know a person rather than if you don't know a person at all you know what i'm saying so let me say people that are signing under you so there's no way they're going to be backstabbed let me say i make a 50k can i trust that i am going to get it back from the one group it did or any, I, I, any I assume, if you can sue them you're supposed to 100 percent get it back 100 percent. but if it ever comes to a situation where like hey, yo my withdrawals not coming in, and you're in one of my groups or my vvip groups i can see your message and i can send it forward to the ib manager and say yo my client hasn't received his payment what's going on and then they can get sued for that like millions you know okay over a low 50k true coming from him guys i Definitely trust them. The thing that I think that I see most when we all go through your YouTube, okay, no, no, I think Instagrams and TikTok, right? Where people be asking you, bro, when are you dropping? When are you dropping? And so forth, True. right? I want to ask you personally, so I don't think anybody's asked you that in front of a camera, I think. Is uh, do you ever see yourself doing Forex over YouTube? Uh, no, 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 no. Forex was just so that I could make more money. I, I like, I, I like money. So I like making more money. All so. of us do, man. So <laughs> I've never do. sacrifice YouTube for you for forex. For forex yeah. okay. so. And and the boy is gonna be coming up with hard content, and he's be is he's gonna be more consistent. You guys gotta see his new plans that came out. If you guys haven't watched it yet, the video of the new house and him looking for the top content uh, creators, right? We in the crib right now, and yo, it's mind blowing. It's mind blowing. I said, guy, I can't even explain it, man. And I've been here for a while. I've been here for like almost a week, right? True. Almost a week. So, and, I, and he's been treating me so good. I swear to God. Like, Sesh is one of the most genuine people I've ever met. So, enough with the Forex things for a bit. You know, let's get a little bit personal. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know people that asked him this. So, I wanted to know it personally. So, I want to ask him, like, your most memorable ex on the internet is obviously Tando. We all know that. So, I'll be the first one to ask you, do you miss her? Before Sasha answers that question, somebody please tell me who taught Panda how to play basketball. Break his knees, baby! Break his knees! Woo! Oh. Bro, he's not trying to flinch or something. Tell you something, Bros Blender. Let me tell you something, game. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> Damn it! Say, son, I ain't got my shoes on. Ah! Yo! Now, nah, bro is a menace. Bro is a menace, brother. Show him what you got, Panda. Double is in the chat! Bro's jumping with the ghost! Bro is trying to school, school him with flip flops, imagine! Damn! Bro took his personal, I swear! <laughs> Do you miss her? Yeah, yo, that's, that's a mad thing. Do you kind of miss her? Uh. No, I, I've, I've, I think I've got, I've had like two years to get over it. Mm -hmm. So is it two years already? Yeah, it's been two years, bro. Yo, I, I don't know. I'm, I may be stuck behind, or maybe or something. I don't know. Nah, I, I've, I've missed her not one time. I think it's just, yeah, it became that thing of like you know it's what it's whatever, bro. Like I grew, up, I grew, grew up, out of it. Yeah. Ah, I grew yeah. up, bro. But it's no bad blood. It's just like sometimes where you just yeah. Like, now, now, now it's like more, more mature. Like if I see the person, I'm just gonna say hi or something. Okay. It's not more like hate or like bad blood, you know. Right. Right. It's more like respect, bro. Like whatever happened then, we're kids. We gotta mm -hmm. grow up eventually someday, you know. Facts. Can't hate someone for the rest of my life, you know. I'm not sure you even hate him. You were just in a moment of where you like him. Yeah, it was just for, for your personal peace, right? Yeah, I think yeah. I think I think I need to let go for personal peace. Yeah, man, can I? That is dope. <laughs> I'm gonna ask. What for... a question, though. Yo, Wait, have you ever gone to the question? No, nah, no. Nah, yeah, no, no, wow, bro. I was like, hey, yo, look, I gotta ask him that. Dog. I gotta ask him that. And then the other one is, um, 
to be honest sasha kind of made her too famous though. you made her famous let's all be honest about that i'm not lying if she's watching this i'm so sorry but it's just the honest truth so i want to ask like do you kind of regret dating tender and making her like become tando that we know she is uh i don't regret anything I don't regret anything. Mm -hmm. I think I think I learned a lot from it. Because if it wasn't for that, I wouldn't have learned that. Ayo, this is how real life relationships look like. Mm -hmm. You know that fairy tale of you're gonna end up in one relationship for the rest of your life and be happy. Mm -hmm. You know these insecurities. You gotta be a man and stand up for your shit. You know some people make mistakes, genuine mistakes. So there's a lot I learned, bro. Mm -hmm. Rather than just the content side of it. But when it comes to that side of it, I mean, I don't regret it, bro. I mean. I think it was a blessing in a way because I mean it created such a beautiful career, mm -hmm. but a curse in a way because I don't of. think she has her own personality anymore. She's living a weird life now. Okay, that is yeah. Um, but yeah, to be honest, I think from my perspective, to be honest, Sasha is a person that loves very much, right? And I before before he answers this, I swear to God. His age or he wants to get married at an early age. Am I lying? Okay. See, I told you. <laughs> I realized that. Or if you need advice about doing better in life, like there are certain things that he teaches me that I'm like, whoa, like that, like that. You get. And having him become a friend in my life has been like really, really life changing. It has opened my eyes to a lot of things and a lot of things that I've learned from him as a person. He's become one of the biggest creators in the country, but he's still authentic to himself, still very kind and doesn't allow the outside energy to affect him that much i appreciate it bro. Thanks. i appreciate it bro. nah anytime last and foremost question guys that we all want to know is should we expect any consistency from you on youtube me personally i always shout him because of this as well true 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 he shouts a lot i man. showed him every time about being consistent <laughs> guys to be honest uh, consistency is something i'm currently working on mm -hmm. i want to give you guys false promises anymore i'd rather say I'd rather cook and then you guys will see for yourselves when the consistency is finally fully back. Thanks. But I'm really trying my best, little best to get my head in the game again and start posting every day. You know, I, I got too comfortable because things started becoming good. <laughs> I forgot I Thanks. forgot I have my priorities mm. and that's not a good thing. So uh, I think I'm, I think I should be back because I'm back. I, th I think I'm back now fully, mm -hmm. but we can only see with time, right? We can yeah. only see with, with work. So we'll see. But... Hey man, we gotta keep cooking, doing our best every freaking day. We wake up every day with our heads up, you know? That's all it is, man. Man, I'm working so hard every day. Man, I'm working so hard.